Hello guys, um, sorry that there are no new videos, uh, I was on vacation for a week, so sorry about that, and, uh, I just didn't really feel like making videos, but I have a juicy story, and I'm a bit late on it, so sorry. If you didn't know, Dream got docs in his quote-unquote face was leaked. I won't be showing the picture of his face because it might actually be his face. So I'm just being safe. Um, yeah. Most of the people start um, fat shaming Dream and doing stuff like that, which is interesting because they're normally the people preaching against homophobia, transphobia, etc., um, it's really weird that those same people are doing that. Um, yeah, it's just false prophets, I guess. Anyway, Drew made a whole response about this, and I'll be reading that today. His tweet says, starting my OnlyFans with Elite to the Twit Longer, and this is what the Twit Longer reads. Okay, the title's a joke, but another day, another drama. Although this one... This is the dumbest one today, as it shouldn't really be a drama, but it is. Recently, there has been a lot of people willingly spreading docs information that is claimed to be about me or my family. I think this is disgusting and harmful and should never be done in any capacity. Spreading potential information about someone's family is horrible and not to mention is against basically every single site's term of service, which is true. I've seen commentary channels show full names and addresses under the guise of its news, which again is dis is just disgusting, and those people should be publicly shamed and reported for even thinking about doing something like that. This is um, a reason why I'm not going to show his face, because um, it could potentially be him, and I don't want to take that um, chance. I've had people spread fake pictures of me, whether they be photoshopped to be with people close to me, like Sapnap, as if we've ever even taken in a single photo, or deliberately planned in a way to appear as believable as possible, <coughs> including saying things like they were found on his mom slash dad's Facebook, which actually was one of the claims made for um, this recent quote unquote face reveal when neither of my parents even have facebook and that's the dumbest thing i've ever heard as if i wouldn't tell my parents to remove pictures of me that's not honestly a good point things like using a photo of carl facetiming me he posted to say look how big he is when the photo is literally just another photo of carl that we photoshopped which is extra funny Obviously, no one is going to or can fact check these things, so it's just touted as fact, regardless of how ridiculous it sounds. I mean, it's the internet, so makes sense. This started a long time ago, and I made a paste bin about it, as it was something being perpetuated along with lots of horrible things by someone who used to be close with me. I don't want to bring it up again, as that was months ago, and I don't want to bring unnecessary attention to on it. So I think he's talking about his ex-girlfriend drama? I'm not really sure. Um, yeah, he... I think that's what he's talking about, but yeah. Um, because a lot of fans, his fans, were sending hate to her, and obviously that's not good. The people saying these things are people with ill intentions t intentions with the purpose of forcing me to face reveal to prove I'm not ugly as there's no other way <laughs> which is just a stupid way <sighs> there's same people who attempted to harass my family and friends for months because of how manipulative and horrible I am for cheating in a block game that, that that's just insane I mean, cheating in Minecraft, whatever, but think about it. Trying to harass someone's family and posting their information on the internet is way worse than cheating in a blog. Come on. Spreading things about me having kids locked up in my basement, which is disgusting for a million reasons. Um, yeah, uh, I think it was a joke. 
I, th I think I think that one was a joke. I I don't know what to say there. And it's Florida. They're not even smart enough to realize no one has basements, which is true. Nobody has basements. I was there for a week. Or other things about wishing I'm a pet. <sighs> That's so weird. That, which is equally as this. Okay, that's that's weird. Why would anyone do that? <sighs> On another note, as someone who has gone through weight problems in their life, I was a homeschool gamer. No surprise there. I think it's disgusting to see people fat shame and ridicule a random person just because they could be dream. I've been fairly open about the fact that I eat fairly specific and healthy things. And the reason that for that is for that is is because I sit inside doing nothing 99% of the time. I've been like that for a few years. I'd be incredibly unhealthy if I wasn't strict with my diet. Sapnap dropped 70 pounds in a couple of months after moving in with me because he started eating healthy food and being a skater boy. Well, he gave me permission to say that, and good for him. He looks freaking amazing, and did before as well. I don't think anyone should be ridiculed for their looks, and anyone that does that is a piece of crap human being. I will say that it's pretty funny seeing people who hate me spread these things and get more and more frustrated as people who watch me don't really care. I play Minecraft with my friends, not model on Playboy. Also, all the creators saying Dreams fan base is so horrible for doing this. Get your facts straight before you look like an absolute idiot. I haven't seen a f single fan of mine spread or even give the time of day to any of that. It's only people who despise me and think it's some kind of win to say, Dream might be fat, low. Felt the need to defend my fans completely on that front. I'm not going to let anyone force me into doing a face reveal, especially not by expecting me to be offended by being compared to a guy that is bigger than me. At the end of the day, who cares? I've said for a very long time that I plan to do a face reveal at a meet and greet type of event, something I've said for over a year, and something that hasn't been possible to COVID. He's literally said this. Just, like, wait for a meet and greet. I don't know. I've recently actually been planning this, though, and we'll definitely have announcements regarding it soon, and I'm looking forward to that. Also, thanks for the added mystery to it all. Now, even people who don't care, like me, will care about it, and even hopefully feel f humbled when they realize how ugly they actually are on the inside. Anyway, I just felt the need to say something due to how ridiculous the situation is and how willing people are to dox people and put people in danger just because they don't like them. Just to reassure people who may be feeling upset with themselves or insecure after seeing all the hate recently, you are amazing and if you are happy with how you look, that's all that matters. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise, you are beautiful. Um, there are some end notes, but I'm not going to read them because it doesn't really matter. Um, basically along the lines of him saying I'm just a normal looking guy and I never claimed otherwise. Um, yeah. Honestly, that was a lot. I think it was a pretty good response to all this nonsense. It's just, this is all kind of crazy and blown up in the past few days. Compared to the other ways he's responded in the past, it was a pretty good response. I don't really have anything else to say to that. Um, if you enjoyed the video, uh, please leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.